Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is February the 5th, 2022. Sundown. Yeah, let's talk about Sundown growers today. I want to see if this market is a buy. I did a video back here in December, planning weekends into the market in Sundown. You guys can tell that that time has come and passed and now price is going up. Is this an opportunity to buy the market now? I'm going to talk about that today on the video, but before I do, this is HFN. We're also known as HFN News. To spot the location that you're going to get price predictions without the confusion, I simply show you all price charts. I don't talk about fundamental analysis. I don't talk about EBITDA, income statements, balance sheets. I don't talk about technical indicators because it is all garbage. You just need to pay attention to what everyone else is trying to do with their own money because money talks. That is the biggest indicator that we need to be paying attention to. And you get all that information by just looking at price bars and volume so if you guys like it you know hit the like button share video also subscribe to the channel follow me on all of my other social media platforms because this is simple and i want you all to join the community so that you will be in the know and not left out in the dark check this out so let me talk about what happened against my last price prediction right here being fully transparent i was telling you all then to expect the price in sundial to go down i even did an update video on the 29th of december yeah, I did another update telling all of my subscribers, hey, I'm still looking for the price in Sundial to go lower. And look what happened. We finally saw that come to pass on the 24th of January. Here it is. It took us a while. It took us about a month. But hey, we finally got it. Right? 20% right there. I wasn't massively bearish. I wasn't looking for the market price in Sundial to completely crash. No. As I said, let's be prepared to see the market try to prop up price around 45 cents. And that is exactly what it did. All right. So let me get rid of it. Now, the purpose of this video is to see whether or not we can actually see price go up in Sundial. First things first. What do you think? Let me zoom in on the daily time frame. Look at this. Are we in an uptrend on a daily basis? This is the bottom. What has what has price been doing so far in Sundial? What has it been doing? Yeah, it's been going up. So what we're seeing here on a daily basis is the market creating support areas. First area support is around 45 cents right there. Second area support is for us to see the market continue to trade above this ascending line. So as long as price stays above both of these two lines, guess what? Yeah, we can play and or at least anticipate to see higher prices come through in the market for sundown growth. It doesn't have to be complicated. The market tells us where it's willing to buy. The market shows us where it's trying to sell. That's it. Those are the only two things you were ever getting in the markets. Yeah, buying and selling. Those are the only two things that can move price. Nothing else. EBITDA cannot move price. Balance sheets cannot move price. A company's valuation cannot move price because your interpretation of valuation can be completely different from the next person. So buying and selling is the only thing that you can be definitive on knowing where the market is trying to go you guys can even see here on the last trading day of last week look at that very widespread the market ended up closing about nine and a quarter percent boom i mean the market is telling us something are you listening take a look at this three day look at this on a three-day time frame here in the market in sundown grows i mean the last two three-day price bars we are definitely seeing the market trying to go up so how high are you looking for the price to go? Because the first area that we can expect to see selling is at 55 cents. Yeah, right there. So we're about two cents away from us anticipating the sellers to appear in the market. Two cents. So you might got to take the probability right there because we are prepared for it. We're on alert. We're, we're lurking to try to figure out, okay, where are these sellers at? Because you know they're here. This is just not a buyer's market. You got people here trying to sell as well. And that first spot is going to be around 55 cents. Okay. Now, maybe we might break 55 cents and hit 60 cents in the market in Sundial. Let's see what happened on the weekly time frame. Okay. So we still saw the market in Sundial, very widespread, price close at the high of the bar. Cool. So, yeah, from a weekly basis, could we see market come up here towards 60 cents? Most definitely. So I'm looking for 65 cents too.
So I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got, what my expectations are. First, 45 cents needs to be maintained as support. All right. As long as the market continues to trade above 45 cents, guess what? The anticipation of price going up is still there. Okay. Now, the first area, price level, is right there around 55. This is not the opportunity to be greedy, okay? Because you guys can clearly see that this market is not going up. It has been trending down. So on every pot we get, you just need to grab it and move on and just be satisfied that you got 4% out the market. That's my first level though. My second level is up here towards 60. It's about 13 and a quarter. Biggest area? It's going to be around like 64. That's 21 percent that we can see the price in Sundial go. Yeah, 21 percent. Now, if we continue to keep this trend, guess what? We're going to continue to see the price go up. But first, we got to make sure that we are on point to anticipate where the sellers are at. And my plan is that they're going to try to appear around 55 cents first, 60 cents second, and then around 64 cents third. Let's see what's going on in the monthly time frame and sundown. Okay. Now I want to show you that this is not a buyer's market. Okay. I don't care what anyone tries to tell you. There has been a plethora of videos created of people telling you all to continue to come and buy these markets. And price continues to confirm it's going down month in and month out. So this is not like a buyer's market to where you come in and simply hold out for the next 15, 20 years. No, it's not. One thing that these YouTubers and all these other people do in their videos, they tell you to come in and buy and buy. They sound like Jim Cramer to where you just buy, buy, buy. That's it. They don't ever tell you when to get out. You got to have an opportunity to take the bag. You got to know where you're willing to take your profitability. So the next five years, cool. But what is your price target? Where are you looking at price in the next five years? So this is what I'm looking at. You guys got it. You guys can see it. Let me zoom in here closer for everyone can keep an eye as to what the market needs to do as we continue to see the price trade next week, next two weeks, next month, next two months. Let's keep our eyes open on this market right now and sundown because yes, I am looking for the price to go up. You guys can see it's right there. Not hiding anything from you all. This is my prediction. Yeah, you can do it. You can actually predict where prices are going to go. Everyone else just, just try to make you think you can't do it. But I'm one of the ones that's showing that you can. I want you want to watch this. All right. So give me your price prediction, your price target in the market for Sundial Growers real quick. Right before the market even moves. You need to be ahead of the game. You need to make sure that you beat everyone else to the price in order for you to win. So what are you looking at? Let me know. Make sure you maintain profitability. And as always, trade different.